Hello, it's Emma and Steve here, and we're at um, Autumn Brook by Taylor Wimpy Homes in Shrewsbury. We've got two showrooms to view today. This is the Brook 2. Now, the Brook 2 is a house that's been a very, very compact um, detached house, which is being phased out um, with, with the new house types. And obviously, from the front, I think it's a very compact looking house, and that's why I think it's one of my favourite house types because it is quite it has come a long way because it was originally by McLean Homes we're going to take a look into this compact three bedroomed house there's a bit of a difference here I've noticed straight away on the brickwork on the door see the, the mortar mm -hmm. is very light there isn't it but over this side it's it's very dark it's just that pillar because it's dark again on yeah the I mean it may, I mean it may just have been pointed up Okay, we're stepping into the brook now, and um, it's quite. It's got it's got a big hall running through it, which is nice. Bearing in mind, this is a very compact little house. This is so. Do you know what? It smells lovely. Yes, it smells it's like a show I should smell. Beautiful. Now it's been a while, so I forgot about this house. But let's have a look around. So we're into the dining room now. Mirrors on there, just to make it look a little bit bigger. But um, I don't think it's a good size. You can get it. It's got a decent size table and chairs in it, hasn't it? That's all it's got, though. Yeah, but I think there's a bit. Is there a bit of room to put anything else? But what else do you want in a dining room, yeah, really? Uh... You know, nice window, very nice, very nicely finished, very tidy. I like the glass doors. Yeah, very different. That's nice, mm -hmm. isn't it? Mm -hmm. So off the entrance hall now, we've got a. Oh, that's the garage. Oh, we've got a garage. Now looking at the garage itself. We can see it. The boiler's in here, out the way. Good. And the nice we've got the stair, what the the actual well of the stair there, which is which is which is all right there. Painted inside um, walls there, so that's very nice. Wait, is there enough room for a car with the stairwell? Yes, I probably think there is, but you'd ne like any garage, I don't think you'd get a um, get get a big MPV or anything in here. But it's got a garage nonetheless, and that's what I'm saying about this design. It's a timeless. 80s and 80s 90s design that's nice isn't it that's quite long very big downstairs yeah thing. quite long this is what fascinates me about this house is that it's, it's it's a small house but it's compact it's a lot in it this is very nice yeah like it's a nice this. screen isn't it yeah nice it is touch. very very good size. standard okay okay the door handles are nice door handles they're you know the doors aren't probably the most expensive doors but that's you know what it's what you're marketing isn't it mm -hmm. so we're going now this is the lounge to the rear garden here um and it's very bright isn't it it's very, very bright very light and bright enhanced with the white furniture, yeah the white yeah carpet. very nice garden natural stone um natural stone patio there I always think what the patio has actually been laid upside down, so you get the roughest, roughest edge of the slabs, but that's builders for you really. <laughs> but it is a nice, nice garden. Bear in mind it's shared by two. The grating isn't great. Yeah, it's but it's because it's the wide, extra yeah, wide grates. Yeah. But a nice patio, nice sliding patio door there. That's pretty simple. Has a big door as well, isn't it? So you've got two sofas, yeah. patio furniture in here. Yeah, it wall. is. I think it's simple. It's it's a Quite sim a nice. It's simple looking, isn't it? Fireplace. Yes, it is very simple looking. Yeah, okay, into the back kitchen now. Again, perfectly, perfectly adequate. Yeah. Okay. I mean, so you've got a slimline dishwash. Built in yeah. Washing machine so it's taken the wire. it's taken away the you've um, not, yeah you've not got a utility area in this house no though, it's so taken you... that away that you don't need it do you oh well, you don't I mean this is ample yeah soft, <laughs> soft closed, closed doors soft yeah closed doors. nice aluminium splash um, aluminium splash back there as well the effect is quite nice yeah actually. it is there's a really nice kitchen and then you've got your good old door out to the your door out to the to the back there, which is yeah. which is fine. So this is built in fridge and freezer. Yeah. It's got everything you need, haven't it really? It has, it's got enough storage. Yeah, and that's what I like. That's it. So the hall, again, I think the hall's quite big and spacious. You wouldn't yeah, think it's a nice shape. Well compared to what you get for most builders though, they they cram it all in, wouldn't they? 
So now we're going upstairs, we've got this beautiful... Just, just quickly as well, with a feature, you've yeah. got a glass door on the dining room, you've got a plain door on this one. Which you'd want for the privacy, wouldn't you? And a half door on the kitchen. Yeah. So a mixture of doors. Yeah, but that's probably, you know, nice, um, nice backdrop wall there to that. Again, a little window on the stairs makes a bit makes a difference. Nice detail on, on that newel post on the corner and that newel post, not just making it go all the way around. It's very good. It's a very tall ceiling. Yeah, it is. That's lovely wallpaper. I like that. Very nice. So bathroom. Family bathroom, yeah. I think it smells nice, doesn't it? it does smell nice. Okay, lovely it's... tiles. It is, it's simple isn't it? Oh, it's not a shower in here, is there? No, which you probably could do with. Mm. Got a bit of beading, Be nice chrome beading around beading, me. Yeah. yeah, but I bet there's a shower hidden here, this little bit here, this little alcove here. Um, yeah, it's a nice bathroom. Yeah, simple. Okay. I would say this is the, the master, bedroom. master bedroom. Yeah, you're right, there's an ensuite with a shower. So they've taken it off there and put it in there, but that's okay. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good. Normal size, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You know, it's it's perfectly, perfectly adequate, yeah. isn't it? The same trim around the bottom that you've got in the main bathroom. It's, you know, good view out the window there, isn't it? You know. Yeah. But a good wide window as well, you know. And obviously, we've got then we've got some glass glass um, wardrobes. glass wardrobes with with a bank of um, of spotlights above them. So yeah. What do you think of the glass and the curtains? I, I don't like it. I think it's quite eighties. Mm, but I we're dealing with an eighties. We're dealing yeah. with a I house just, here I that's. Think that looks. It just looks dated. Yeah. It's going to get dusty as well. You'd end up having to hoover these, take them off and wash them. Yeah. I think okay. just solid doors would have looked but, much But nice. for the size of the room, it's fine, isn't it? It's a good size room, isn't it? would have looked more contemporary. Yeah. Think. Okay. So, and again, we've got a good landing, good size landing, just a basic cupboard there, yeah. which is great. And bedroom two. You see, now the wardrobes in here are very nice. I've just noticed a great little advert there in next door's garden. Um, for a building services there, which is quite actually quite clever of them, because people will be looking out of the window. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but um, artificial grass next door, isn't it? I know we're not reviewing next door, but it looks no, pretty, pretty, no. pretty plain. That's turf. <laughs> yeah, is it? That, yeah. No, uh, that's artificial grass. On next door garden. Hmm. Right, okay then, back to the review. Much more contemporary wardrobes in here. I don't know why they didn't put these in the master bedroom. Lovely curtains, I like those, very nice with the diamonding. It's, such it's a, a nice bedroom. Yeah, it is, it's spacious. Okay, and about finally into bedroom three. Okay. Yeah, it's a pretty little yeah. girls room. That's what I like with Taylor Wimpy, they're not over, overdone. It's a good size are, small bedroom. But they're not overdone, are they? Nice. You know, so that's a nice. It's a nice, nice show. The radiator by the bed. Mm. What that could have gone somewhere else, I think. Yeah, it it's quite a small radiator yeah. as well. Yeah. But I mean, also you could have the bed over here, so it's not just. Restricted yeah, I suppose so. But there. actually, it's unusual. It's going across there because it could yeah. go there, couldn't it? And have the the chest of drawers there. I mean, you might want to put a wardrobe in here as well, which could go yeah. there, couldn't you? So you it's could built there. The but again, for us, it's a small room, but it's it's a good size. Well, it's a good size. It's not. It's. Can not I just tiny. say a good, good, a good sized room? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I well, in terms of the quality of this, it's very, very good quality, yeah. isn't it? The, the standard, it is standard of finish is 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 exceptional. Um, you know, but that's kind of what you get, as I've said before, with um, Taylor Wimpy. You get that kind of standard quality with them. Um, so that's very, very good.